shape, size, style, and in many other ways. If there is one thing in common, to make them work, you push. What if you can push them without physically being where they are? What if you can make them work automatically on their own? It's a microbot push, the tiny wireless robotic finger that can push any button. Now I can push this with your smartphone. Push is very easy to install and use. Just attach it on the surface where the button you want to push is located. Pair with this companion help portal box and use your smartphone to push it from anywhere, anytime. Even from outside. No wires, no tools required. With push, you can control your light switches, turn on your home computer for more play music, start making coffee, turn off electric fan, and many other things. It's only limited by your imagination. Push is simple yet very sophisticated. We designed the gears and PCB from the ground up for the lowest possible power consumption and the maximum torque to push most of ordinary buttons. In fact, you don't even need a smartphone to use it. It just works. Protobox is the brain for microbots and it's what automates them with other sensors and services. Using its groundbreaking user interface, all you need to do is scribble a note that describes how you want to automate your microbots. The autocomplete feature will also help you write rules. With Protobox, you can start making coffee when you wake up, get things on your desk ready when you enter your office. lights when the sun goes down, and a lot more, all automatically without your smartphone. Today's world is just so busy. There's endless to-do lists, there's stressful jobs. Sometimes all you need is a place where you can just breathe a little easier. And that is why we do what we do. Say hello to Pura, the world's first truly smart air freshener, fully controlled from your mobile device. Pura works differently than any other air freshener. You can tailor it to your lifestyle. Pura allows you to create your own schedule of fragrancing with options to control the time and the rooms that you want to be fragranced. And with two fragrances per dispenser, you can even control which fragrance you want at any given time. Each Pura dispenser also has a USB port to ensure that you don't lose access to your outlet. Why waste money? Pura dispensers automatically turn off when you leave your home. When you return, the dispensers resume the schedule you've set. And regardless of where you are, from your mobile device, you can override the dispensers and turn them on so that your home will smell great before you arrive. The Pura dispenser is really different from other fragrant dispensers, I mean, obviously because of the functionality of it. But when you, when you put it right next to a, something that you get at a convenience store, you know in seconds that it's different. It does something different. It's supposed to do something different. And then all the feedback we really got from a lot of people using it or seeing it and going to contests was, was great validation to either keep certain aspects of it or change certain aspects of it without ruining or taking away any of the functionality of your plug. Each dispenser has a smart night light and with over 16 million color options you'll be sure to find color to match your style. Our goal is to make sure your space smells great without the hassle. We're very excited to bring to you Pira, the world's first smart air freshener. We have been working very hard and the entire Pira team is focused on creating the highest quality product for you. We will continue to make sure every aspect of Pira exceeds your expectations. We can't do this alone. We need your help for tooling and to enter into production. Please help fund Pira and we'll bring you a touch of fresh air. Thank you.
My name is Laurent Schnauer. I'm co-founder of Fly. I'm really passionate about new technologies and I naturally fell in love with drones when I first met them a few years ago. I'm convinced that in the future we'll have flying robots around us helping us in our daily lives. But before that, we must overcome a few challenges, in particular with respect to safety and usability. So what we did at Fly is to go back to the drawing board and invent the flying robot of the future. It had to be safe, robust and with a great user experience. We've been hacking around in my attic for about a year, building prototypes out of Belzebuth and DIY electronics. And after many, many trials, Fly eventually stayed in the air and proved to us that it was uh, all possible. So based on this, we managed to convince uh, Pierre Loest, who is a famous Belgian uh, entrepreneur, but also a talented drone pilot. He became really enthusiastic about the project and decided to invest. When I saw for the first time Fly, I tout de suite compris que c'était pas un drone. C'est autre chose. C'est comme un dessin de Da Vinci ou de Spielberg qui prend réalité devant vous. Prenez Fly en main et vous comprendrez pourquoi j'ai décidé d'investir dans ce projet. What makes flying design so innovative? It's made of a single shielded propeller and four control vents for stability. It has the same size and weight of a soccer ball. It's packed with sensor, a powerful onboard computer, a HD camera, and a Wi-Fi connection. We want it fly to be smart and autonomous, so you don't have to be always piloting it. You can select a simple mission through the mobile app and just enjoy the live streaming. <laughs> Fly is a lot of fun to play and interact with, but it's more than a toy. It's really a platform on which you invent the future of flying robots. We have two APIs and an SDK which enable developers to create applications for controlling Fly remotely or when on the onboard computer. It runs Linux and supports the popular computer vision library OpenCV. You can make Fly autonomously detect and react to what it sees, like tracking someone or something in a room. Fly is really amazing because it's in the air, but it doesn't seem mechanical. Uh, when I saw the fly, the first time flying, I was really impressed about the simplicity of the construction. It's, it's so, so amazing, simple. And if it comes too close, you can just push it away and it, it, it moves again and you don't hurt your fingers or anything else. We now have a complete functional prototype of fly and we are ready to enter the production stage. So when you support us on Kickstarter, you are showing us that you share our vision and our enthusiasm. So we invite you to join the flight crew, make a pledge, and let's build the future of flying robots together. What if a photograph could come to life in your hands? What if you could print a GoPro video or an Apple Live photo? What if you could instantly send your friends a magical photograph from your surfing trip or a photo from the concert of the century? Well, with LifePrint, you can. So there's basically three major things that make LifePrint really great. The first is our ability to give you easy access to all of your special moments by integrating your social media and video into our app 
We seamlessly integrate with GoPro, with Apple Live Photos, with Instagram, with Facebook, with Vine, with Twitter. And then we also integrate your iOS camera roll and your Android camera roll, right? Basically, the point is, is that we're giving you super easy access to any photo or video you might want to print. Next, what we do is we can add an augmented reality video experience embedded into any photo you have. This is called Hyperphoto, which is really cool. It's, it's like magic or something. And then we can portably print and share these Hyperphotos to anyone in the world within our network. And of course, you can print all of your regular still photos too. The augmented reality piece just adds something extra only if you really want. The third thing that makes us special is our social network backend. This allows you to share your photos all over the world. Now this is actually something that we're really proud of because when you take a photo, you probably want to share that moment with someone, not just keep it for yourself. Think of us like a physical version of Instagram. I'll also say that when you send someone a photo, they have permission to accept the print or not. So you're not forced to keep printing photos of your aunt's cats over and over again. And we designed life print to be incredibly high quality. We designed it with long lasting materials and a minimalist design language. And we've intentionally made it to be lightweight and small enough to fit in your pocket. And portability is really key here because it allows you to share these moments in person. So you can bring your life print printer to parties or on camping trips and then share these moments with your friends. And we even have sticky back film so you can slap it on the bottom of your skateboard or on your fridge or wherever you want. And for our GoPro users, we've designed a really special ruggedized case that protects the printer so you can feel safe when you take it out with you in the field. And we require no ink toner to print. We have a partnership with Z Ink, which means you won't ever need to buy ink for this product. It's another great feature. So today we're offering you a better, richer experience for your photos by integrating augmented reality. We're giving you a chance to share real photos with your friends and family, and we're giving you the opportunity to put all your photos and videos into one place within our app so you can easily free them from the prisons of their digital screens. We do this to capture the magic of holding something real in your hands. So if that sounds like the kind of thing you're interested in, we have all sorts of amazing pledges for you. And be sure to share our project too because we're giving away free film when you share this and tag us on Facebook and Twitter. So don't miss out on that. You can just check out the referral section below. So thanks for watching all the way to the end of the video and uh, we appreciate your support. All right, here we go. And we, des uh, <laughs> and we designed life, why am I saying that line weird? <laughs> And we designed, we designed.